So Mason Rudolph today got benched in in favor of um Hodges um for the Steelers, the third string quarterback. And I'm saying to myself, hmm, did Mason Rudolph get his karma? Now what are you talking about? Okay, I'll show you what I'm talking about. Now we all know what happened with him and Miles Garrett in the uh Thursday night game. A lot of people saying that you know, Mason Rudolph did play a part of, of what of, of, of what Miles Garrett did, you know, by swinging a helmet at him. And people say, oh, well, you know, he should be suspended at least one game. Well, that didn't happen. And today he played against the worst team in the NFL with the Bengals. And he got pulled. So, you know, is this the, the karma of him not getting, not getting any type of punishment? You know, they, they did say they'd find him. You know, but for the last three games, you know, this guy's thrown five interceptions again for only one touchdown. You know, if, if you take, you know, if, since that Ram game in which they won, you know, he's thrown five interceptions you know, and only one touchdown. So, and the funny thing is, that earlier this season, I, I made a video about, you know, is Mason Rudolph, you know, is he is he going to be the successor to the Big Ben? And, you know, that's nope. That's no longer the case. I think Big Ben, Big ben comes back next year and the Steelers draft another guy. Because Mason Rudolph is showing you that, you know, he's a young guy, but, you know, he's not ready. But is this karma for Mason Rudolph for him, him being pulled against the worst team in the NFL? When you can't function against the worst team in the league, hmm, that's saying something. Who knows?